when we had last left V. She was just straight up murdering people. Some of it unintentional, but some of it really very intentional. And people were kind of pissed and sad about it, but, well, what could they do? <laughs> this is Cyberpunk 2077. Welcome back. Good lord. <laughs> Let us continue on with our side quest of Palooza. Let's head on over to this. There's a merc needed, and guess what I am? One of those. A merc. Let's see. Have we ever talked to who this is? I don't know. Because if, if this is Regina and Wakako is like, well, no, because this is, isn't this, yeah, if this is Kabuki, then doesn't that mean that this is Wakako here? So then this must be Regina, right? Well, I don't know. I don't know. Maybe we should, yeah, let's look into it. It's right there, right? I wish there were a way to mark stuff as like, hey, guess what, you asshole? You've been here and looked at it before, right? <laughs> You've already seen what this has to offer. Let's grab some shit here. here, here. Healing stuff. Okay. Head on up and around. Good. Nice. People like rolling dice or something. Yeah, this is definitely where Wakako lives, right? Yeah, okay. Okay, we don't need to fuck with that, then. Let us continue over toward... Well? This is probably our fastest route, right? Yeah. We'll just run over there, I guess. Okay. Let's do it. Oh, hey. Who are you? You lonely, honey? I can help. What is this? How come they were... they had like a mark on the... the HUD? Can we come in here and have like a sex fuck? I don't think so. Man, look at this. Jeez, they fucked so hard that like... the bed almost exploded, they lodged a like penis pump into the wall, the door collapsed, pizza boxes like blew all over the place, alcohol and booze. And then just to finish it all off in their last climactic moment of orgy, a whole bunch of roaches just moved in. <laughs> oh no, the roaches are moving in. <laughs> That's the best way to know your partner is satisfied. A horde of roaches, a plague, ensues upon the land. <laughs> the fuck? <laughs> all right, let's see. Let's grab one of these. Boom. What do you want? I want your car, you fool, you butt. Get out of here. You better look out. I don't care about anyone's life anymore. All right. Let's see. Over here. Yeah, so I'm driving with keyboard and mouse. That's how fucking reckless I am right now. All right. What even was this? Was this like a rescue a person mission or whatever? Sure. Sure. Look, we enter from this alleyway. Okay. Okay, and then up here we go to the left. I don't think I can fit this fucking van down this hole. <laughs> okay, here goes nothing. Ah! Uh, sorry, ma'am. Sorry. Oh, gosh. Oh, get out of here. You don't want to see this. Oh, she's getting blown back by the exhaust or whatever. Oh, look, it's it's blasting her. The force of it. Help me! <laughs> okay, let's get in here. What is go. happening? Ah! Oh, God. Hey, Wakako. is unresponsive. In spite of clear orders to remain in direct contact with me, something must have happened. He would not dare go against me. Familiarize yourself with the brief, and proceed swiftly. I need him. Okay. Who will take care of my mama? Who <laughs> will take care of my mama? Let's read this. Gig type, SOS, Merc needed. Objective, locate Netrunner, Chang Hoon. 
uh, oh, Nam, 65 years old, reg regular associate, location, restaurant on Crescent Street. Details. For years, I worked to get jobs done comfortably with a crew I handpicked myself. I chose Chang Hoon Nam years ago, and he hasn't let me down once. I don't know what happened to him, but you must get him back. Check the basement in that Chinese place. He keeps his gear there, sometimes takes a side gig or two. I think he's still alive. If he weren't, he's the type who'd come back as a ghost and apologize. Just like those tales in those tales from the old country that make me want to puke. He's sentimental like that. This is one of her fuckboys, huh? Okay. Oh, shit. Careful, dude. There's a bunch of fucking bombs down there. <laughs> Jeez. Okay. I feel like they'd get a similar effect and be less conspicuous by just, you know, locking the door, but sure. Look at this. Lotteria. La Bota. La Mano. La Rana. Oh. Okay. Sorry, I've never taken Spanish except for, like, very basic Spanish. Let's see over here. Oh, look at all these things, huh? Is that to distract you? You're like, oh, the beautiful neon. Oh, no, bombs everywhere. <laughs> I guess if you don't have the requisite skill, you just have to, like, shoot these or something. Maybe you could slide down them, right? Like, yeah. That. Do one of those numbers. All right. Let's see. Man, it's very dark in here. Do not adjust your television set, viewer. Everything is normal. You have simply entered the cyberpunk zone, where everything is real fucking dark. <laughs> hey, what's this? Gig info on Vortex. Uh, that seems important. I've already got someone on this job. We could use some help. Try to follow Vortex's footprints on the net. There has to be some trace. Send whatever you find directly to me. W. <gasps> Who could it be? Wakako? Must be. Okay. Get some of that. Personal notes. Spectral Kid. Derek Craddock, 67% collocation match. No time match. Not him. Amir Owens? Question mark? Byron Irasa, 74% code coincidence. But too old. Spectral is 13 years max. Dwayne Roberts? Question mark? UX97, inactivity. Encoded? Jenny Baylor, Beller? Question mark, setup failed. Tish Lyles, check with T-Bug? May know her. Huh. Does, is that how we met T-Bug through Wakako? I can't even remember and it was so short-lived our like relations with T-Bug. Okay. It's like that was the, all that stuff was from like the prior game before they decide to um, remake a whole bunch of the shit, right? Isn't that the story with Cyberpunk? A lot of it got, like, scrapped and then refashioned at a certain junction. Alright. What's up? You alright? Hey. You alright? Look, V, it's you in the near future. Every net runner ends up the same way. Brain fried by some corpo ice. Looks like he's still breathing. Am I a net runner? I didn't pick a class yet, John. Fucking rocker boy. Blaming Bart Moss by Bugbear. We met Bugbear and saved them. Let's see. Sniper ammo was this. I don't know. I think it's part of the gun that we picked up. Oh, hey. Johnny, I think they're trying to... Oh, Johnny's gone. <laughs> okay. Let's see. Let's see. Oh. Kang Tao container. I see you're trying to get your hands on the KT container. You couldn't fucking wait for me? 
from Chang Hoon to the Spectral Kid. Manage on my own, thanks. You fucking trying to prove something, you fucking Tato brain? <laughs> the old guard will never give up. We knew how to get things done in my time. That kind of bullshit, am I close? At least tell me you're using that splinter I sent. Without, they'll hard boil your brain. No bullshit, a gramps like you has no place jacking around this place solo. No need to panic, I told you, I'll be fine. What, this some kind of last hurrah going out with a bang? Some other cliche? No, what, I don't give a shit anymore. Do whatever the fuck you want, you stubborn old fossil. Oh, Wakako says, Nam, you are needed today. Update now. Receive my message, what's going on? Also from Wakako. Oh dear. All right. I guess we need to follow the lights, huh? God, what is this? All right. Oh. Let's read this. Jajang Mian Recipe. Ingredients, sin pork diced into cubes, potatoes, zucchini, <laughs> zucchini, <laughs> carrots, onion, and garlic diced into cubes or thinly sliced. Fresh udon, sesame oil, one tablespoon, starch and water mix, three tablespoons. Yayang paste, one cup. Protein substitute, Min Khoi's stall, new deliveries on Thursdays, genetic code, yada yada or yada yada. Vegetable substitutes, Aldecaldos transports, ask Dakota. Sauce substitutes, from upstairs kitchen, Sunyang, Wednesday morning. What? I think we've heard of Aldecaldos before as well. Look, another one of these recipes. People be cooking. Got a snack there. Something here, I can't, I can't see shit, man. Oh, follow the lights, huh? Okay. What happens if I lose them? Holy shit, I'm so fucked. Um, okay. That's what I'm saying, dude. Oh my god. Oh my god, look! Force open 20! Yo! What is in here? What could it be? I can't believe that. One that I can't do. Okay. Oh, jeez. We have to go down here, open this. This is kind of cool. Oh, shit. Bombs. Okay. Thank goodness I can do this. Alright. What is this? It's an info visor. Okay. Purple one. Uh, what's over here? Netrunner's shard. I took the shard. That's kind of cool. Except for the fact of uh, it's not reactive to the player, you know, falling off the path. <laughs> okay. Slot it. Seconds. Uh, wait, I, I can't. Wake up. <laughs> Give me one moment. I don't know how long I hear, but. As you Americans say, I'm starving. What? <laughs> I think people everywhere say that. I have granted I haven't been everywhere, but I've been a few places. I can say that in those places people I can say see that. <laughs> you're not in a rush. <laughs> you're in luck. There's a restaurant upstairs. I know. The whole time. Those aromas. What torture. So you were conscious. Partially. More like in deep hibernation. Did you switch on the lights? Yes. 
I was ready for a game of twice for yes, once for now. But you beat me to it. Once for now? Fine work you did. Was that a typo that was into the script and it made it all the way to like the reading room and they read it out? Huh. Do you need a moment? Oh, sorry. Any idea what's in the corporal code case? You young people ask too many questions. See for yourself. <laughs> Maybe it's not such a good idea after all. Ha! Ah, you're a fast learner. So, you're probably wondering who sent me. Wakako. She always find an excuse to drag me to her place for dinner. You must visit me someday. I'll show you a few net running tricks. Wasn't it me who just saved your ass? We never stop learning hard lessons. But you don't have to do everything alone. Thanks, I'll think about it. What? What a weird exchange. What a truly bizarre exchange. Is it just me or was that like truly bizarre? Did I like miss something? Did something go over my head or was that just like weird as shit? Oh, hey, and this is the room that was super locked, right? Oh, so we could have skipped all of that. I gotcha. Okay. Man, that was... I don't understand what the fuck we were even talking about, really. <laughs> oh, shit. Am I gonna be cool if I go through these? I can't disarm them. They are green. I guess we were fine. I was like wincing the whole time in preparation for the explosion. Okay, let's head on out. Leave the area. I was informed of how you handled yourself. Good work. I expected nothing less from you. I am closing the contract. Thanks, Wakaka. Okay. Is there anything else good around here that we should tend to? Um. No. <laughs> the freaking fuck out. Over here. Anything. Not in particular. Okay. Let's bring up our big map. What else do we have around here? Meet Takamura there. Anything else? Let's see. These are fairly low danger, aren't they? Yeah, look at all this. Okay. Yeah, all the things in this section as well are quite low. Shit, I guess we ought to do them, huh? Okay. There's another side job right here. Huh. Okay. Yeah, we can come back for that. The fast travel thing is right there. We'll hit all these little units up. Why not, right? Alright. Up we go. There we go. And look at that. Jeez. Are those... The titties are just out, huh? They've got, like, little tentacles and stuff on them. Jeez. Okay. Okay. Good lord, I'm probably going to have to blur that. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Okay. Let's see. Over here. Mercy! Jeez, I probably am going to have to blur that. Hang on, let me... <laughs> let me just pause this real quick and write in my notebook the time currently. So I can find it easily. Let's see. Um, about... There. Okay. Uh, good. <laughs> Fuck me, huh? <laughs> Gosh, I hope I remember to check my notebook. You wanna kill someone? Kill them. Okay. Let's head on over here toward this. Good. Oh shit! I should really use my gamepad. Okay. I'm grabbing it. We're free falling down here. There we go. This is your history. I'm gonna make you history. This is a vasectomy. Let's get over here. Oh, excuse me. Oh, Jesus. It is a symphony for a vasectomy. <laughs> we will give you a vasectomy. <laughs> the fuck? Alright, what's going on over here? Hey, folks. Boom! You! Okay. Bow! 
Man, what were those numbers? Those were some big numbers there. All right. Good. I love it. Oh shit, I'm encumbered. Okay. Oh shit, I'm I'm recumbered. Okay. Let's take all this. What am I looking for? Oh, a bod, a perk shard. Whoa, useful. What kind of a perk did I get? I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. I got the feedback of the cool noise, but it hasn't said what I've gotten. Maybe it's just in general, a general perk. All right, let's read this conversation. Between Toru, Inagaki, and Ryohira. They kidnapped me in the trunk of a car. Damn it, I told you about contract on out on you. Told you to leave. Help me. I'm locating you. Who grabbed you? Fuck, not now, please. Did you get locate location? Yes, Japantown sending boys. They must be careful. Right. Didn't make it. Didn't fucking make it. It was Maelstrom, too. Got taken out by, uh... Look, wow, another perk shard. Holy fuck. Double down. Okay, another conversation between Seamus Sawaki and Mike Martinez. Fourth one today. Tea claw this time. Fourth choom, I got a lug all over town. Couple days back, I was stuck in traffic in Kabuki with some choom in the trunk. Fucker died on me. I mean, not like he didn't have it coming. Whole car reeks now, even though I scrubbed it down. Fucking mercs. All their fault. They fuck. The fuck they think we do with these people? Take them on vacation? Come one, come all. Shit. <laughs> all inclusive. Paris, Rome. Come on over! Limited time offer! <laughs> Fucking hypocrites. They can't just put them out of their misery like normal. No, they gotta dump them on us. Plus, you're there, stressing they'll catch you with some gonk in the trunk. Enough to whack a chew mount. You're telling me? Hang the fuck on. What's up? Got somebody on my ass. <laughs> Your jammer on? Fuck. <laughs> All right. Let's see. Anything else around here? Look, we can stuff some of these bods inside the bod machine. There we are. How many bods can I fit into that wonderful bod machine? Should be all three of these, right? This bod machine can fit three whole bods. It's bod beautiful. Going to hell for that one. Let's see over here. Oh shit. Oh god. Here we go. Great! What a delight. Let's bring up our map. What else have we got? This, a reported crime. All right, let's see what they got going on. Oh, here, let's buy a food. Yum. Okay, run over this way. Let's see. Should we just run the rest of the way here or what? Now, let's get into a vehicle, huh? Let's get this thing. Boom, breaking in, busting in. Okay. Then, oh, we'll use it to cross the street. Excuse me. Look out, coming through. I'm a maniac. You better look out, dude. <laughs> I'll run you down. <laughs> the fuck is this? Well, there's some weird shit going on up there. Look, I'm going to do my secret maneuver. Ah, double jump. I love it. I love the double jump. Oh shit. It's the Robot Wars. Yeah! Take that, Robot Wars! Oh shit. It's old Laser Eye up here. With his wild butt. 
Okay. GIG. All caps. Give it a read. GIG data theft. Target Brandon Holt's sub home subnet. Details. Got a political gig for you. Client wants data from the home subnet of Brandon Holt. You know the last name. He's Weldon's cousin. Candidate for mayor. Looks like it's a family business. Brandon's on Weldon's campaign staff. Seems this Holt also likes to visit Mexico and have a little dirty fun there from time to time. Apparently, he records his little adventures. My client would like to see those recordings. Thinks they could be very interesting. So grab them for him. I guess we're doing it then? Or what? No, I, I guess not. That's it. Kendachi Micro 76 info log. Whole bunch of weird shit going on. I think that was the log from the shit that they had found. What about you, Robot Wars? What's up? <laughs> looks like, looks almost like a fucking VR headset. <laughs> Doesn't it? Oh shit! It looks like a super hyper advanced VR headset that includes like um some earpieces for your, your audio needs or pleasure. Okay, I'll never find out what's in there. Now, who is putting shit up here? How's this shit getting up here? Are people just like throwing like what even is this? It looks like a clothes washing washboard thing. Oh no, it's like a it's a cardboard tray like you would put fruit in it or something. Okay, and this? All foods? It's like a laptop or something? No? No, it's not. It's like a... It's like... It's like a baseball plate or something. <laughs> okay, sure. Let's see. Let's bring up our map. What else have we got? There we go. Very low danger, or just low danger, I should say. Are. Head on over. Very well, look, we're very close to level 25. How exciting. Alright, will we make it over in time? Whoa! Oh, look. A bunch of cars just like trashed and piling up here, huh? Got some money in there. 591, not half bad. Okay. Loads of Yu Gi Oh cards. Okay. There, up here, and just a little up and over. Good. Uh, oh shit! Oh god! This is the this is the place. Hey hey hey! Punch your feet! Punch your feet! Oh shit! Oh shit! Come on, V! Just juice it, just juice it big time! Ran out of stamina so I couldn't sprint. Oh god, that guy like deflated like a hot air balloon or something. It would be so cool if when you busted their skulls in, like, you know, electronics came like blasting out or whatever, huh? Okay. Hey! What's going on? What the hell happened to you? All right, let's see. Wow, look, this rocker jacket with anti-puncture mesh is somehow better than what I'm wearing? Yeah, I don't believe that. All right, archive conversation between Tanya and Andre. Listen, I don't deal for Maelstrom anymore. As of yesterday, I run for the claws. That wise, honestly not scared. They pay me more, way more. New apartment types of more, and protection. Be a leadhead not to take advantage. Hope you're right. Wait and see. Why they hit you up anyway. Connections. And I'll be their bridge, smiley face. Bridge to what? To the cause? 53 Quatlus. Conversation between Carl and Molly. We got a mark on Tanya with the Tigers. She betrayed us, slinging splinters. She's running for him now, Maul. Shit, and here I am, out sending out people worried something happened to the stupid cunt. Fuck, 
fucking Tanya ducking, sir. Fuck fucking zero her. <laughs> Chill, we got this. Yo, we got her. Says we don't kill her. She'll give us some intel, data worth something. Ah, oh, fuck that cunt! I'm on her head! I'll whip the data out myself! Why that fucking cunt stay? Make her an example to the rest! Jesus Christ. Fucking cyberpunk, huh? Fuck me. Alright. Let's see. Over here. 35 big ones. Okay. Good. Oh, shit. Did you see that for a bit? Oh, reality faded and returned before my very eyes. Okay. Should we check out this clothing store and bar? I think so, right? Because we do need to get rid of some junk. And I'm ready to do it. I'm ready to do it. I'm gonna do it. You don't know what I'm capable of. Look at me go. <laughs> Sorry, I guess I'm in a weird fucking mood, huh? Let's see. Let's stow away my fists. Let's see. Over here and then on the right. Have we been to this area before? I think we have, right? But I'm not sure. Alright. Oh, yeah, I think we totally have. Well, no, we haven't. We haven't spoken with you before. Recommend anything. Stuck on where to take my style. Anything you'd recommend? Your eyes remind me of autumn. Might I suggest a piece from Chiaki, Kyoto? Yo, my eyes aren't even real. <laughs> what's good here? What's, what's good? Whatever you desire. Oh, okay. Is there actually anything good here? Oh shit, look at that. Predator. Huh. 25% bonus damage against high threat and moderate threat enemies? What does that mean? Huh. Jeez, look at the price on that shit, though. Fuck me. A tri-layer steel corset. They sell some peculiar shit here. Puffer vest? Carbon triangle graphene weave poser jacket. Was oh, that the one from all the, like, trailer art and stuff? But this one is a Netrunner jacket. Huh. I'm thinking about buying this. That said, we won't be able to use it for a while because I don't know... Well, can we rip clothing mods out of shit? No, we can't yet. We need to get our crafting up. Huh. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe we'll just leave it there. Because it's so much money. It's almost all of our money. And what if we find, like, a piece of cyberware that we want to stick in us or whatever, right? Let's get rid of this thing. Melee weapons. Oh, my gosh. So many melee weapons to pawn off here. There we are. Clothing. Some of these weird-looking hats. There we are. We'll just get rid of all these, like, common items, huh? Why not? Okay, that seems good. Okay, that ought to do for now. Right? Neat. Look. Huh. Would be cool if you could, like, look at these and then buy them, right? Look at each individual piece, buy it, and then, like, it flashes to black or something real quick, and you equip it. Look at all this junk. Jeez. Hmm. Neat. Okay. Let's get on out of here. Let's see. Where is the bar at? I think it's right up over here. Yeah. Should we go in here? We may as well. It's locked. Okay. How do I get in? Maybe that's not it. Ah, this one is it. Okay. Oh, just a dead person? Looks like it. At least you're wearing Jinguji. 
You're dead, but at least you look hot as shit. Out of my sight, you disgust me. <laughs> I know. Nice place. Nice place. Quaintly slick. Hmm. Is it? Nice place. Nice people who behave, who pay. No tolerance whatever for individuals from Watson. Jeez. You got a menu? Yes, we have. Okay. Yeah, well, it's just it's just food. We don't need that. Nope. Oh, oops. Okay. No wow. Jeez. The like. <laughs> the like porn ads are really evolving lately. It's got to be said. Okay. Let's go on out over this way. Should we check out the Ripper Dock thing here, real quick? I think we should. You know what? We got this money burning a hole in our pocket. What well, if there's some like incredible cyberware modification right here? Right under our nose. Okay. Let's see, right over here. If we come across a car, we'll take it, I guess. Well, look, we're already less than 100 meters away. Yeah! See, honestly, I should get. You should get athletics XP for jumping over cars like that. Look at this. This is like an official Ripper dock or whatever, huh? Hey. Look, uh. I don't talk to people I don't know. You picked a weird job, dude. Oh, shit. It's Chappy. <laughs> okay. Anything else going on around here? No? All right. You new here? Seem to remember this ugly, slimy gonk type with oozing flesh running the shop. Really? My uncle is not a handsome man, I know. But he is hard to forget once you see him. Preem, yeah. Nothing like serving up a howler first time you meet someone. Talk to him. You think it's a mistake to speak the truth? True or not, it was rude, hurtful. What else would you call it if not a mistake? What? Ah, and that is why I love to travel. Words. We think we know how to use them, but then there is context. What the fuck? <laughs> I don't know your ugly ass uncle, apparently. <laughs> have I been here? I don't think I have. What the fuck? What are you talking about, Nina Kravis? <laughs> also, could you imagine if she said, if we said that and her response was like, you take that back. My uncle is sexy as hell. He's the hottest man alive. <laughs> what a just an odd line of conversation to go down. Like, I know he's not the sexiest guy, but come on, cut my uncle some slack. He's okay. <laughs> just start out in this biz. So just starting out in this biz. No, I move around in this biz. I run shops in Irkutsk. Leningrad, Vienna, and Glasgow. I thought it was time to try a night city. My uncle rented me the shop because it was my birthday. I'm 30. I will sit here and run the business until I get bored. Okay. Why do we have so much we can say to her? This is so weird. Are you like a real person or something? Is this like another weird cameo moment? And I just don't know this person? Is this, is this person famous? <laughs> So, our city of dreams. What do you make of it? It's wonderful. Compared to the USSR, so different. Like it that much? Really? Yes, terribly. You shoot at each other in the street. You must pay for first aid, emergency help. It's a nightmare, but so interesting. <laughs> Been thinking about getting some new chrome. Then I think you'll come to the right place. Okay. Let's see. What have you got for me? Mm, no ledges there. Eyeballs. Should be nothing. Yep. How about this circulatory? What have you got here? Nothing. Just greens and grays. Immune system. Nope. Nervous system. Nope. Integumentary system. <laughs> You like that? Really, really nailed that one, huh? Uh, what's this? Tetratronic Rippler Mark IV. Sounds like some kind of kinky sex toy, honestly. 
All right. Oh, look, Militech Berserk. Oh, this is the really good one, I think. Hmm. Duration of 10 seconds, cooldown of 60. Okay. Gain 40% more health while Berserk is active. Max stamina increased by 40%. 5% health on kill. Okay. Weird. The Biodyne one seems so much better. Because this one gives you melee damage up by 45%. I guess maybe this one is better for survivability? I don't know. Yeah, this seems kind of like ass. Granted, it has double the duration, but also practically double the cooldown. Huh. Yeah, I don't know if that's worth it. Okay, let's look at Skeleton. Oh, shit. Synaptic Signal Optimizer. Increases health by 60%. Bionic lungs, stamina increased by 60%. Okay. Micro rotors, increases attack speed by 20%. Is that just melee attack speed or everything? Hmm. I wonder if this is one of the ones that only goes up to epic. Oh shit, this requires reflexes though. No good. Okay. Arms... And legs. Okay. Interesting stuff, though. Let's see. Should we get one of these? I'm kind of tempted to get this one that increases your health, right? At the very least. I think we do it. Let's also equip that. There we are. Yeah, let's get this one that increases our max health. Cool. Cool. We'll buy it and we'll uh, pop it in later. Lovely. What does this do? Increases... Okay, damage to mechs and shit. Oh, shit. Animal's knuckles. Causes internal bleeding on successful hits. It's for gorilla arms. Huh. Should we just take that? Hmm. I think maybe we should. It's only five grand. There we go. Sure. Let's see. Can I easily remove shit from this or what? Let's see here. Like if I want to change out the mod to this. So right now it's physical damage. And let's say, okay, I want fiery fists. Oh yeah, I can just swap these in and out willy nilly. It costs nothing. Okay. Sure. Let's get the animal's knuckles going then. Why not? Great. Do they look any different? Oh, I can't pull out my fists here. They're too dangerous now. Oh, no. They look exactly the same. Okay. Oh, let's pop this open. And what have we got over here? Should we do this? It's only low. We may as well just run over. Here it is. Actually, no. Let's grab a vehicle. Look at this big ass thing, huh? Oh, they're listening to this cool song. <laughs> I'll fuck you, I'll fuck you, I'll fuck you all up. <laughs> Good lord. Okay. And then... Up and over here. Oh, there we go. Cool. Let's see. Who are you? Veteran guard, no affiliation. What about these people? Veteran guard, no affiliation. Okay, well, let's fucking get them. 
<laughs> I love it. Enemy contact. I'm engaging. Yeah, there's your contact, dickhead. Boom. Ugh. Awesome. Come out with your hands in the air. Oh shit. Let's take this target for elimination. Do a quick read. Contract payment status paid in full. Target Rick Morales. Profession Techie Tunnel Construction. Associated with Aldecaldos. Biometric data height five foot six. Stress response highly nervous. Target is hypersensitive. Risk of impulsive behavior. Skin tone light. Contract basis theft of proprietary business information on the construction of a maglev tunnel. Sale to third parties. Okay. Surrender immediately. Oh, shh, that's bad. Donk. Boom. Okay. Look at this. How many bodies can I fit into the back of this thing? Yep. Up we go. Oh. It goes into the... Oh, okay. I guess we can't get any bodies into that. Fair enough. Over here, though. There we are. Good. Then let's get you just as well. Take all your weird stuff. Thank you. Need that stealth XP, you know how it is. Okay, and then... Take your junk. Ooh, there was a sh thing there. New shard target for elimination. Oh, paid in full target Morales. Okay, yeah, all the same stuff. It's just that they had mission accomplished or whatever. Good. Dump you in there. And one more bod. Yep. Cool. Love it. Oh no, wait, yeah. Up here. Oh, look, archived conversation between Rick and Unknown. Rick. No, too low. By how much? Double it. For one measly shard? You don't like it? Go in that tunnel yourselves. Find a way through. And I know you're with the Aldecados. Not like you're hard up. You're an Aldecado too. Yeah, I was. Deal or not. Deal. <gasps> what could it mean? Okay. We're like in a really, uh... I don't know, what do you call some of this? Fascist looking area! <laughs> I don't know! <laughs> I don't know what else to describe it! <laughs> With all these, like, grays, like... <laughs> white and gray with all the, like... I don't know, fluorescent white lights. <laughs> I don't know. Okay. Let's see, over here. Huh. Should we check out this moderate job or what? Well, let's let's do this crime thing right there. We'll wrap that up. We'll circle around town. There we go. Oh, you know what? Uh, this is all like Arasaka shit. Right? This is like their aesthetic or whatever, right? I don't know, it's like my favorite overbearing cyberpunk dickhead aesthetic, I think. That sort of clean-cut shit. I don't know. My favorite for antagonists and all that. Alright, let's head on over here to this unit. Okay, ooh, shit. Oh god. We're not even tracking it anymore, are we? Huh. Look at that, yeah. There we go. Alright. In reverse. Do a little whoopity-woo. 
then, up here on the left, find Dante's Den. Okay. Sure. We gonna get a call from who? Wakako? Shit, I don't know. Oh, hey, look at all this. Ooh, nice. I've been to one of these kinds of restaurants before. I forget what they're supposed to be called. There's a specific name. But my gosh, it's so cool, and you get to watch them, like, cook this stuff. Shit, I can't believe I for It's not like it's a really uncommon name. Like, they're in a lot of different places in America, at least. Okay, I want to order wanna something. Order something. Uh-huh. Go ahead. Okay. Yeah, it's all just food. We can sell this shit, though. There we are. Oh, it's, um, hibachi, right? It's a hibachi grill, right? Or am I thinking of something else? Isn't that what this is? This is a hibachi? I think so. Oh, shit. There we go. All right. Good. This is the place. <gasps> There's no one. Oh shit, skill shard breach protocol and a bioconductor. Turn that off. Good god. There we are. What have we got in this? Any deets? Come on, give me the deets, Choom. Messages. Oh shit. Oh shit, it's directed to Chang Hoon Nam. What do you mean? Where? Oh my god, Dante, I don't know what to do. I really don't. What? Oh, and this is porn spam. Okay. <laughs> okay, over here. Grab some of that shit. Yep. Bounce back. Lovely. Okay. Oh shit, look at this. Huh. We've never seen this before, have we? Is this, like, unique to this section? Okay. Cool, wow. So the whole thing was just to open that up and go in there? I think it was. Weird. Alright. Cool. Well, holy wackadoo, I suppose when next we come back, we will investigate some more side missions around here and all that, right? Definitely avoid speaking with Takamura and all that stuff. Maybe Judy will call us again. Will she ever forgive us for murdering that lady? I don't know. <laughs> I didn't mean to. I used my fist. I didn't know it would kill her. <laughs> I mean, even if I tried to use a weapon, it probably would have killed her anyway. What can you do? I guess I knew it would kill her, but I didn't have much of a choice. I, I knew it would kill her, but I didn't have a choice. These hands are only made for killing, Judy. I don't know. I, I can't stop it. It's I'm a murderer. <laughs> Until next time, please take care of each other.